<laughs> what is good YouTube right here again making another video talking about some boxing and I want to talk about a topic a lot of people don't talk about maybe because you know they don't think about it as much hold on give me a second I got some loud noise I got lowered down I see on my screen, it's Fight Night Round 4, and you got Diego Corrales and Arturo Gatti. Two guys who were not really skilled. They just like throwing a million punches at each other. As you can see right here, throwing millions of punches at each other and probably missing. But then again, they have no defense. But I want to talk about boxing snobs. Yes, you can be a boxing snob. What does that mean? A boxing snob, in my opinion, are these guys, and there's a lot of these guys, who they think that, they think pretty much if you like guys like Brandon Reels, Toro Gatti, Ruslan, John Molina, uh, James Kirkland, you know, guys that are, you know, they're not really skilled, they just like to fight, Margarito, you know, guys that just go in, they're just swinging for the fences. There's boxing snobs who are like, oh, that's not boxing. This is this is just no skilled guys with no defense, just swinging, they're getting hit. You know, they're these these people who, you know, they like guys like Reagan Down, Floyd Mayweather, and Andre Ward, and I'm trying to think of some other technical fighters, Hopkins. Like these guys like masturbate over that shit. Like, oh man, did you see how Reagan now? He stepped the corner and he counter punched him so effectively. Then he got out of the way. Like, okay, good. It's, I'm, you know, whatever. You like that, but not everybody likes that. What is that? Not everybody likes that. Okay, not everybody's like a big fan of that. And the thing with these guys is, if you're not into that or you like the brawls, you're apparently you're like, oh, you're you're a casual fan. You you don't appreciate the sweet science. No, I mean. Some people, they do appreciate the sweet science, but they also like seeing action, entertainment. And these boxing snobs, they act like, oh man, this is, this is terrible, man. Like, this is not a good fight. There's no technical skill. It doesn't always have to be technical. I mean, I like brawls. I like, you know, skilled fighters. I mean, um, I also like fights that are in the middle, like when Floyd fought Canelo. It wasn't a technical fight, but it wasn't a brawl either. It wasn't too technical because Floyd Mayweather was on his front foot. He was trying to make a fight. Canelo was being, I don't know, he was being mentally challenged and he wasn't fighting. I don't know what the hell he was doing. He was just being on the outside. And Toro Gatti gets stunned, but he's going to throw a million punches or he's just going to block. But, yeah, that's what happens. Oh, Corrales gets stunned. What is this? What is this, man? Oh yes, this is what we need. Come back. We'll we'll give you Floyd, give us Gaddy and Corrales back. Give us these guys back. What? What did I say? Was that wrong? No. But yeah, it's crazy, man. I don't get it. I just don't get it. But yeah, you know, you like I like brawls, I like technical fights. I just don't like when the boxing snob wants to criticize you know, a person when they like seeing uh, Ruslan and Mike Alvarado or, you know, Brandon Reels and Mike Alvarado. Like, okay, you know, they get happy over that. If you don't like it, then you don't like it. You don't have to watch it. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to fucking watch the fight. I mean, why is it that these people are like, oh, no, this isn't boxing. This is horrible. They're like, no, it's boxing. You just don't understand it. You don't like it for some reason. Or maybe you do get it, you just don't like it. Maybe what it is is, maybe your favorite fighter is a technical fighter. And you feel he's not getting um, the fan base he deserves. And that sometimes that happens. But this freaking notion or this just mentality that, oh man, man. You know, brawlers or you know guys that throw a lot of punches and guys that get hit a lot. They're not skilled or... That's not real boxing. I mean, you know, you say whatever you want about Brandon Rios. He gets hit a lot or he has no defense. The guy still puts effort. He still works hard. He still tries to get better. 
You know, some guys just don't aren't talented. They don't, you know, they're not physically gifted. You know, they're not phys physically gifted like a Reagan Dow. Pretty sure if a guy like Reels had the speed of a Floyd Mayweather, he might be better. But no, he's not. You know, he's the, he's he's taking advantage of what he has. And I don't think, like, Floyd Mayweather, you know, some people complain, oh, Floyd Mayweather doesn't brawl enough. No, he obviously doesn't brawl enough. He doesn't have any fucking power. I don't blame him for not trying to brawl. If you don't have any hand power, if you're fighting guys who are 10, 15 pounds bigger than you, you're going to brawl with him? No, you're going to box them. <clears throat> so, yeah, there you go. Boxing snobs, man. I don't like them. I think they're annoying. They think they know everything. They, they, I don't know, they, like, they try to be smart asses. And let's say, let's say you're a beginning, I don't know. This is my last point. And the, and the, and the worst thing I hate about boxing snobs, let's say you're, like, a new fan or kind of casual. And, like, they, they, they just, they try to act like bullies. Like, oh, man, you don't know this, you don't know that. You're, oh, you don't know anything. Like, so what? So what if they don't know it? Don't. Don't hate them. They're trying to learn the sport. Maybe instead of being a prick and thinking how much of a god you are at your boxing knowledge, try to help them out. That's all I'm saying. Anyways, guys, I'm out. Peace. And yeah, there you go.